the office buildings of the top 10 global law firms by gross revenue in 2022. So on the charts, you see the top 10, um, Kirkland, Ellis, and basically in 2022, they almost hit 6 billion US dollars in revenue. Okay, they're the largest one. But look at the 10, and on the left hand, I put the locations of the office buildings for you. And you will see the five of them actually located in China World Trade 1 or World Trade 2. These are vicinity buildings. These are belong to the same complex, but two different towers. And then the other fives are basically, uh, the other four actually have offices in Beijing, which is the capital city of China, and they are all in vicinities. Although they're in different buildings, a Beijing Carry Center and ZT International Center, but they're very close, and I will show the map. And then the last two company, uh, the, the law firms, I put it here, they're ranking 25th in terms of growth revenue in 2022, and the other one is called O'Malveny 50. The reason why I put them here is I want you to pay attention to these two, because these two actually in the unrestricted warfare that we shared with you um, um, uh, um, in, the, in, the, in the previous show episodes that MyScore has 70 plus legal cases and uh, the CCP brought against him in the United States. In order to do that, the CCP has to hire lawyers. And these two has jumped out um, because they hired lawyers to deal with the most prominent cases against a mile score. And these cases has been for years. And that's why I want you to pay attention. Paul Hastings, which is right now a trustee, is coming from the Paul Hastings and appointed by DOJ and working in the bankruptcy case in mile school. And O Malvini has been hired by, um, you know, uh, PAX, uh, one of the donkeys, which I shared with you in my previous show, his name is called Shan Wei Jian. He is the chairman of the PAG and suing against Miles. Um, using O'Malveny. Okay, so this is all going to come together. But